Good morning guys and welcome back to another dusty episode. Today I've decided to make two wall clocks. Um, I took a, a piece of wood to somebody to engrave them for me. Um, just to show you a quick peek on how they look. There they are. So while I'm going to be busy just marking out the rest of my markings on them so I can cut them out fully and start sanding, I'm going to throw you back to the footage on when I went to engrave them. So enjoy.
Okay guys, so this is what I've done so far. As you can see there's still a line there. I'm going to sand to that line to make it nice and smooth. I also drew a block out at the back that I'm going to route out now because um, the mechanism that I'm using needs a 10 mil space from the top to the bottom for the arms to go around. So before I'm going to do anything else, I'm just going to route out both of their backs. And there the first one is done.
now that both of them are done, I can just clean myself and my workbench and then I can start getting dusty. Okay guys, seeing that I'm done with the routing and all that I basically have to do is sand down. All I'm going to use do is I'm going to use my sanding machine and I'm just going to sand to all my edges, make them nice and smooth. And then I can sand my top. I'm going to do that by hand with uh, either 220 and then 400 or I'm just going to go straight to 400 grit. And then I can just seal them off and put in my mechanisms. So with all that being said, let's get dusty. <sighs> I think this side is going to work, but I'm just going to check my belt and then I'm going to go 1%. Now, seeing that all the sanding is done on the edges, on both of them, all I can do now is I can sand my face and I think I'm only going to use 400 grit for that and then I can seal them off. Okay, before I'm going to start sanding, I've decided just to burn my edges a bit, uh, just to give it a bit more character. And now that all of the burning is done, I can start sanding. I'm just going to move my camera and then I'm going to sand and seal them off. And then I can wait for them to dry. And as soon as they are dry, I can put in the rest of the stuff that I need for my wall clocks.
And now seeing that both of them has been sanded down. Now all that I need to do is I'm just going to seal them off um, with a clear coat and then I can just put them together. Okay guys, to seal off these wall clocks I'm going to use Woodock, um, a velvet interior sealer. Um, I love Woodock, they make really really good products. So let's seal them and see how they turn out. Seeing that both of them are sealed now, I'm going to give them roughly about 20 minutes to half an hour and then I'm just going to sand them down quickly again. I'm going to give them an, about another two coats, put um, the mechanism and the arms in and I'm just going to put the chain at the back uh, for them to be able to be hanged from a wall. So I will see you guys when I'm just going to assemble everything. Morning guys, um, it's actually the following day. Um, I already went and complete one of these wall clocks. That's how this one looks. And then I'm going to complete the one that I'm busy with now while I'm on video. Now with that, um, yesterday I only gave, um, sanded it down, I gave it another clear, um, sealer coat and then I sanded it down again. Then I went to my varnish and I just sprayed it um, three times of clear coat varnish um, and it came out beautiful. So let's just complete the wall clock and yeah. I already went and put in my back brace, my mechanism. So all I need to do now is just put in my arms. You're seeing that the one battery doesn't work. Um, all I'm going to do is I'm going to run to the store this afternoon and I'm just going to get a new battery. So guys, if you enjoyed today's video, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel. Um, just to show you how it turned out. Here's the one wall clock. And here's the other wall clock. I think they turned out very beautifully. Okay guys, before I end this video off, I would like to give a shout out to the wood wizard, um, the uncle that helped me engrave uh, these two wall clocks. I really love your work uncle and I'm going to do a lot more by you. So guys, if you went on to enjoy today's video, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel and then I will see you at the next Dusty episode.